And here is the first lesson, what to do. Thing is, you know now that it's very easy to take away the security umbrella for you if you have it in front of your body. So, now I tell you how to hold it the proper way, and this is by your side. That means your whole stance is sideways, like this. And then the umbrella comes here parallel to your body, like that. One hand is on the back, on the, on the handle, and the other hand is on top here. And the most important thing is that the umbrella is far away from me. That means when I go, when I close in to do something, she has a lot of power and she, she had a, 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 yeah, she has a real advantage and she has a huge momentum that will hit, hit me here, okay? So that's a very important thing. That means if she's like that, sideways, when the umbrella is there, I can't take it away from her. Remember the first thing where she had the umbrella like that? All I had to do was this, but no chance here. That means if I try to grab the umbrella, I have to go forwards, closing in, and if I do that, I'm just running into the tip here. And trust me, that will hurt, okay? Next thing is, why sideways? Hmm. Um, if you are frontal, like that, when I go and push her, you know, some people do that just to bring you out of balance and probably to throw you down. And if you are like that, your legs, like this, frontal to me, I have a huge impact and you have no balance. And then the whole thing looks like this. Very uncontrolled situation for her, not for me. I am in control, she's not. But when she is sideways like that, it's a total different story. Because when I push her now, it's like, oh, oh yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping for more to be honest. <laughs> yeah, okay, good. Well, and this is no fake, okay? I was expecting her to go minimum two or three steps, but that's, okay, it works. Thing is, now she's in control. I push her, but she's able to balance all the time, and she's able to hold eye contact to me. Yeah. So I can't do anything to surprise her. And it's also important to keep the majority of the weight on the hind leg. Right. Just to, so if I'm pushed like this, then I'm already on that leg. You see? So, even if you're not so safe about the, the, the back leg and the thing, you have much more balance, what she said right now and what we demonstrated here. A sideway, when you stay like that, when you stand like that, you are in control of your own balance. That is very, very important. And when you have the umbrella, like I told you before, like this, okay, even if she does not hit me right here, if I push her back and she has to, she has to go back to find her balance again. She is ready to strike like this. Okay, well, that was fast. Okay, Woo. okay, that was, yeah, okay. You know, we do it a bit slower. Slower, okay, <laughs> slower. So when I push her back like this, she still, she's in control. And that's the main difference between standing sideways and standing frontal, okay? Again, when you are frontal, when I push you here like this, I'm in control, not her, not you. When you are sideways, and I try to push here, she's in control, or you are in control. And again, very important, you hold the umbrella right by your side. And so the tip is always pointing into my direction, but I can't grab it, okay? Very important point. Good. Yo. <laughs> and here is 
the promised summary for the last chapter. Um, we agreed on one hand is here and the other hand is there. But now I'm going to explain you in detail why you hold the umbrella exactly like that. There's a reason. In fact, there are more reasons. Okay, so uh, in, in the chapter was everything explained on how to stand, the side stands. So I think that is clear, just like that. Now, um, in this case here, my right foot is back. That means my right hand has the handle. My left side is towards you, towards a potential attacker. So my left hand grabs the umbrella. But, and that's point number one, it always has to be like that. Okay, that means the hand comes like this and you hold the umbrella with your hand on top, like this, like that. Never like this. Why? Thing is, the leverage, the law of physics, interesting thing. Okay, now, you hold the, the security umbrella like this and you have your hand here. And now you bring up the end here, the rear end, and then, you know, try this at home, but slowly, please be careful, because this will hurt in the wrist here, because your wrist can not go more than this, not further than this, and that, you bend it over that point, and that means two things. Prob you know, you open your hand and you lose every grip and control, or you break the wrist. And this is the last thing you want, right? So, never like this, always like that, always like this. Second, the back end here, the handle. It's very, very important that you always create a right angle here, always a right angle. You know, even when you, when you close your hand later on, yeah, sure, of course, but if you open your hand, it always has to be like that, always a right angle. Why? Because when you have the security umbrella like this and you go, you, you, you strike, you go forward and you strike, it is very, very important that you have the maximum power transfer. And that will only work if you have your hand like this in the right angle, because that way all your energy, all the power, the momentum is brought directly into the direction, all exactly in the line of the security umbrella, into the tip. So, you now the next thing is, if you have the umbrella like this here, and your hand is probably like that, or over here, all that happens is this. You go like here, like this, or this is. Okay, so a right angle here, you hold it here, close your hand, of course, and then you are good to go. And now here's the next thing. Um, it may look more adventurous. It may look more, hey, if you hold the umbrella like this. But that's not good, because if you have the umbrella out here and you strike, all you do is you strike here with your underarms, okay? That's all. Like arm wrestling, where you do this. This is all, you know, this is not so much. Okay, I would not like it to be poked like that, but it is uh, nothing compared to what you can do. Okay? You know, for example, you can use this hold to, you know, when you're waiting somewhere in a line and someone goes in before you could say, hey, you, hey, there's a line back there. Hey, go away. This is, for that it's perfect, but that's all. So, what you have to do is, one hand here, the other hand here, just remind always the right angle here, and then Keep it close to your body, like that. And that is 
if you have it up here or if you have it down there, you know, that it's always the same thing, always close to your body, here or here, doesn't matter. Thing is, when you have the security umbrella here and when you strike now, you can bring the momentum, the weight, the power, the energy of your whole body into that strike. Bam! Okay? And then, then it will be very, very effective. Compared to that, the other thing, again, it may look more adventurous, but it's, it's not very good because, you know, I wouldn't do that. Try that, try that for yourself, you know, take, take an old pillow, something to put it on something on your couch or just go out in, your, in the garden, just put a pillow on a tree and then try to, bam, to do this. Try it like this and then try it like that. And you will see, you will feel the difference, okay? It's like I said, you know, sometimes things look very good on camp. But in reality, they simply don't work. So, okay, always think about that. You have to bring your power in a straight line right here into the security umbrella. And imagine that all your power, all the force, the speed, the momentum, all this goes right into this tip, you know, this little tiny thing here. And this is a thing that will stop. I think everybody, okay, okay, depends on uh, probably, you know, if somebody is wearing um, thick padded jackets and stuff, well, but watch closely. In one of the next chapters, I'm going to explain that you don't have to strike just once because, no, watch it, just watch it. Hey, <laughs> I need to keep you curious on the next chapters, okay, so just to sum it up here in the summary, right foot is back, right hand is here, back here, back here, and the left hand grabs the umbrella here like that. If you change the whole thing, now my left foot is back, that means I have my left hand here on the handle, and my right hand grabs the umbrella, huh? Mm -mm. Exactly from here. And it's the same thing. You hear to bam, close to your body and bam. And then you can really push here and then you can strike. Again, you know, this looks probably more impressive, but this is way more effective. So, and um, well, here we go. Next chapter.